Hey, what is up, everyone? This is Dark Sage 101. Welcome to kind of like another chill series. Uh, just kind of like uh, videos here and there, uh, like in between like series and stuff. Uh, this is gonna be Roblox uh, Azure Mines. Basically, it's kind of like uh, Miner's Haven, but you actually mine the ores <laughs> and not just have them, you know, come out of droppers. Uh, it's actually made by the same guy, uh, uh, Bereza. So, yeah. Uh, this is a very old game. Uh, I think it's like 20... 2015 or something like that? 2014? It's an old game. Um, so, yeah. Uh, this is going to be kind of like a chill series. Um, so, yeah. And as you can see, I... Yeah, I'm kind of strong. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm at a Overlord. And I have tons of crap in here. So, yeah. Uh, I've been doing a lot of, you know, you know, chilling and, uh, you know, mining and uh, the private mine because I hate doing the uh, the public mine because every time I go in there, people love to steal my ores and stuff. So, yeah. Uh, ooh, I cannot pass that up. Okay, so, um, this video, I'm kind of just going to be chilling, just kind of doing whatever. Uh, upgrade that. Um, and, yeah. Uh, yeah, we can sell that and sell that. Uh, so we're basically going to be mining for kind of whatever. Um, I actually recently did some Newtonium mining. I uh, got all the way up to... Right there, 148. Uh, I just wanted to get a whole, all stocked up as well as get the emblem. So technically I got over 200. <laughs> It took me yeah, like two hours, maybe three hours. It took it took me a while to get all of it because I'm maining a mithril pickaxe. Um, it already takes me long enough to get down there. So, and of course I use the uh, teleport trick because why would I not? Um, so yeah, uh, let let me actually make some more teleporters because I'm actually running low on those. There we go. So I have seven. All right, and oh, it's safe, so let's go. And like always, I do that. All right, hold up. There we go, auto mine. I always do this because, you know, it's tedious getting down here, so. So we're gonna go all the way down to, it doesn't really matter, um, I'm good, just gonna be, uh, you know, getting stone and stuff because I need like, I think like uh, 200K stone just so I can uh, upgrade to the next pickaxe, which I think is Newtonium. So that's the reason why I got that early. Uh, I've been trying, kind of just mining loads of crap, you know, just Prometheum, uh, Newtonium, um, a bunch of new ores added to the, uh, to the zombie loot pool. Um, so, yeah. Um, what's, I, I may basically the reason why I've gotten those because they're really good for uh, emblems they look cool so uh, is there anything in here not really oh yeah I also got the laser it's it, it wasn't even I was like you know what this is essential so I might as well grab it and yes I'm using surrender bite because it, it uh, just so I'm not spending like a year trying to get down there so that was how fast that went with the laser. Watch this. Yeah, see, look at that. See, so much slower without the laser. I'll just get these two amethysts. I'm getting low on the amethyst, and also topaz, too. Let's see how fast topaz goes. If I uh, laser that. Oops. I'm really inaccurate with that. Oh, wow. It's like barite. Without it, wow, it's still really fast. Uh, I'm also going to be getting diamonds, too. I need those. Okay, I don't want to go over there. Okay, let me just mine back up. There we go. Okay, where's my hole? Uh, right there. Okay, so, about here, yeah. 
All right, there we go. Oops. Yeah, I guess I'll do it without the auto mine. Yeah, I need diamonds, uh, barite, rainbow knight. Uh, I need azure. Um, and not really a whole lot else. Uh, mostly diamonds is what I need. I need about 300. So. I need 100 for the research thing uh, for my, uh, my pickaxe. And I need 200 more for the actual pickaxe. So. Uh, it takes about eh, somewhere around maybe five minutes to get all the way down. Shoot. Oops. Sweet. Soften all these guys up. Because I'll be mining all of this. Sweet. Yeah, I might as well just do that just so I can reload it. There we go. Because I need the diamond. I'll be doing this and Europa Universalis. I'm taking a break from uh, Andron Saga as well as Geometry Dash. Geometry Dash, you could probably see why, because I died at 97. That Oh my gosh, that hurt so much. Um, and then, as far as Andron Saga goes, um, the way the main character died, to be honest, was really stupid. Um, I did not like how they wrote that. Uh, how they wrote that. I'd say that was really... I don't know, it just didn't feel like there was a lot of thought in that. Like, why would Mortimer help us? Let alone, why would he help us kill Randall? Like, before any of that crap happened, why couldn't he just kill Mortimer? Oh, I'm not Mortimer. Why couldn't he just kill Randall and, uh, and Bottomon? He could literally just blame it on someone else, easily. So why couldn't he just do that? Like, why would he help us? So, yeah. See, I don't know. It just didn't feel very very well written. I'm almost dead. Um, yeah, it's just my opinion. It, it could have been better. It definitely could have been a lot better. That's probably the low point of the series right there, because... I don't know. I just don't like how they how they wrote that. That, that like that definitely could have been a lot better. But you know, what are you gonna do? I didn't make the game, so. Oops. I'm almost dead. Oops. I'll explore these caves later. I'm just making a hole. Actually, how fast is Serenabite mine while I'm doing this? Oh gosh, that's slow. Even with the ray gun. Well, yeah, we are using a Serenabite pickaxe. With a Mithril pickaxe, it takes about, about 50 seconds, maybe. Maybe a minute. That's my main pickaxe. That I usually do that. Uh, use that while I'm like around 2,000 debt. Just so I can uh, mine things quickly. Um, I can go for Symmetrium, maybe. Go for the Emblem. I said that, I actually see nothing wrong with that. I just gotta put the, uh, the Teleporter down. Yeah, I could probably get down to 2,000 before the mine conditions go to critical. Yeah, that, that shouldn't be a problem. We're already yeah, almost 1,000. Let's just mine the Serendibite. Also, if you're wondering, do I have the Emblem? Nope. It takes forever to get that Emblem. Plutonium. If you're wondering what the most useless ore in this game is, uh, probably plutonium. <laughs> probably. A uh, strong contender for one of the worst ores in the game. 
I think it's used for like one upgrade, and it doesn't really give you that much XP. 6,000 is okay, but for how long it takes to mine the darn thing, it really isn't worth it. Like, I'll, I'll, I'll find a plutonium really quick, and I'll just show you just how long it takes. But let me say, I, I am using a, a Serena by, so of course it's going to take forever, but... Let's see if I can find a plutonium. Yeah, and I'll show you just how slow it is. That was probably a uh, Azure or something. No, Azure's like 1400. Unless they've changed it. Oh, great. Let me do that at least. Oh, shoot. Um. Okay, I'll use that as like an indent in the wall. Let's see here. Um. Well, oh, hi, dude. Uranium. Okay. Uh. Okay. Yeah. Plutonium. Look. Look how slow this crap is. Okay. What? Can you go away? Oh, bear right. I'll take that. Yeah. Look how slow that is when you do that. Of course, I can use the laser, and it looks like that. Yeah, but like, look, look at that. That's like barely any XP. I'd rather use. I'd rather do barite. Oh gosh, uranium takes forever. That's well, taking about as long as almost topaz when when I do that. Huh. Interesting. Oops. Topaz gives you a lot too. Topaz is kind of a nice ore because you can uh, use it for a few upgrades and stuff. And it's also uh, pretty common in the marketplaces for selling. That probably takes really long. Eh. I'll mine at least one, but I really need to get down to uh, 2,000. Uh, I think it's like 2,500 or 2,600 where it spawns. Uh, fire crystal is what we're looking for, by the way. Mining conditions are risky, yep. Also, yeah, this server is completely dead. Uh, the game itself is really dead right now. It's barely getting double digits. I saw it get to almost 100 players, and, and now it's at, like, I think, like, 50 right now. But I'm not surprised, because this, this game has been out for ages, so... The fact that it has any player base at all is pretty impressive. It it does get updated, um, usually about once a month, maybe once every couple months, and usually they just add like an ore or two. They added a bunch while I was gone because I haven't been on in like two years. Look how long that takes. Oh my gosh, I hate plutonium. I'm just doing that just so I can get a straight drop down. Alright, there we go. We're about 1400 right now. Copper. Alright, I, I, yeah, I'm gonna stop and mine that. Where, where is that? Oh, gosh. Uh, I don't even know. Oh, there it is. I see it. There we go. We'll zoom out. Great. Oh, uh, oh, jeez, what's it called? Uh, Break Calcum? 
Yeah. Uh, that's one of the new ores that got released. It's pretty good, actually. It gives you a lot of XP. Yeah, 85,000. That's no joke. That's really good. Really cool emblem, too. Okay, I just want to do that just so I can get... Can you get out of my way, Mr. Sands over here? Sorry, I'm not mining that. There's actually an Azure over there. Let me grab that. Oops. Let's see how slow this is. Okay, not as bad as I thought. I thought it was gonna be like, like, uh, like the plutonium. Or actually, no, uh, like m more like the uh, the uranium. No, this is actually quite a bit faster. I like. Gives you quite a bit of XP. I think it's like uh, twenty. Yeah, twenty-five. Surprised there's no rainbow knight in here. Copper. Did I not really? Okay. More copper. I'm so poor on this crap, so we need to grab this. Grab that. Oops. I have a marker where it is. It's yeah, it's right there. I'm not gonna bother mining that. I guess so. This is this. Yeah, I'm not dealing with that. It's a good ore, but like, dude, like it takes way too long. By the time I mine that, the, the mine conditions are already going to be like risky, or not risky. Uh, it's already going to be like dangerous or whatever. I'm more focused on just going all the way down, so I could do what I wanted. Great. Okay. Oh, it's a present. Uh, present. Those actually can give you some really cool stuff. Gosh, I love the ray gun. Uh, the ray gun, if you don't know, um, I think it's like, it's like 200 Robux or something like that, which is like, it's like three bucks. I was like, you know what, I'm, I'm fine with that. Whatever, I'll, I'll grab it, it's nothing. I don't mind too much. It's convenient. It's just so I don't have to spend a year just trying to mine stuff. Oh boy, here we go. Okay, I'm gonna run over here. And I'm gonna go Call of Duty style over here. Are you serious? That... That spread, though. Oh, that's, uh... Frostbite, I think, is what that is. Oh my gosh, look at all the enemies. Normally, you need a sword to do this. That's, uh, Oricocum. So many zombies, oh my gosh. I'm only gonna mine the ones I want, like the Frostbite, the Diamond, and the, the Oricocum. I already have tons of Platinum already, and I already have the Emblem, so there's no point. Jeez, so many zombies. There's still one right there. Okay, I think that's all of them. There might be, like, one left. I'm just softening all these. Of course, it's this guy. Get off. Good. <clears throat> I'm just trying to, trying to mine as much as possible here. That frostbite is so easy to mine. And it gives you so much EXP. Look at this. Yeah, 25. For how, for how easy that is to mine. That's like barite level. I'm not going to bother mining the opal. That takes really long. Like, like, yeah. I don't need like half of this anyways, so. Also, I'm sorry if that's bright. 
Oh gosh. Zombie. Um okay, there's still some white child coming here. Oh my gosh, my eyes, my eyes. My eyes <laughs> that meme. Basically what this is. So bright. If only there was like a nuke item or something that I could literally just get all this in like one tap. But nope. No, something like that would be like five hundred Robux. Easily. Cause they'd like to overprice things. If I ever made a game, the cheap, the literally like the the most expensive thing that that would be in my game would be like a hundred robux. Probably not even that. Like I would have so many things that are like I don't know, like like do you want to uh, like if I made like a mining game or whatever, like do you want to like let's say if I had like a ray gun or whatever, it wouldn't be two hundred robux. It would be like twenty five. <laughs> So, there's no reason to overprice it. No, it'd be like 25. So, maybe even free. Cause there's no, there's no point in pricing it. So, because it's absolutely essential. Oops. Did I lose both my legs? Nah, I just have one leg. I think I got everything from this. Yeah. Okay, where's my mine? Right there. I don't think there's anything in here besides that. Yeah. Alright, all good. Wasted some time there, but totally fine. We needed all that. Especially the diamonds. Those are extremely good for what I need to do. Because I need, like, like I said, I need, like, 300 for these dirt, uh, 300 of these darn things, 200 for the, the pickaxe, and um, 100 for the uh, mine upgrade. That's another present, great. Okay, I gotta figure out a place to snipe. What the heck? Oh. Get out of here. Uh, protected stone. Oh, there's a uh, torch. Okay, well, time for more loot. Let's try not to die. That's certainly possible. Okay, more or chalkum. They just jump around. Also, that noise, if you're wondering, that's actually Vati, which is kind of funny, uh, from Legend of Zelda. I can already tell what noise that is. Or what that what that laugh's from. That's Vati's laugh. That's funny. Seems like Bereza has played Legend of Zelda before. Oh my gosh. Look at all the crap that just dropped. Oh my gosh, there's so much stuff. Oh my gosh, we're going to be in for ages. Yeah, we're going to be in here for absolutely ages. Look at how much loot's in here. What the heck? Great. Get off. Oh crap. That wasn't smart. I'm stuck. Still stuck. Great, I'm stuck in loot. Okay, there we go. Jeez, there's so much ore. Move. Move. Okay. 
Well, we have a lot of stuff to mine. Almost all this we want, so... Um, I actually do want to weaken that, because they take really long to mine. Oops. Yeah, sure, why not? Let's laser those. Laser these. Okay. Okay, uh, not the opal. I want the copper. Oops. Oops. Or chalcum. The reason why I'm just getting the or chalcum is just for the um, the emblem, nothing more. I don't think it's used for any upgrades other than like maybe like uh, the Valhalium or whatever, whatever that ore is. It's one of the brand new ones. Makes an OP pickaxe, the uh, best one in the game. Mhm. Mm ba uh, back when I actually when I quit the game or whatever or got off for like two years, uh, Newtonium was the best pickaxe. Now I think it's like third. It's, it's either third or fourth. Second, I know, is uh, Promethium. Promethium actually got a pickaxe. Yeah, although back when I quit, uh, Promethium never got a pickaxe. So. Nope, it was just Newtonium. Although, at the same time, I did, did Promethium exist? I think it did actually. I think it actually did exist. I don't think it had a pickaxe. Uh... Oh my gosh, how am I gonna get through here? My mind's like right here. Ugh, oh, jeez. I don't wanna mine all this. I don't wanna mine like the syringebite and stuff. Like, it's gonna take forever to mine. I guess the platinum. Oh, jeez. This is the definition of too much loot right here. Like, oh my gosh. Oops. Okay, just mine this. Oh, so much loot. I should not have opened that prison. <laughs> I, I, uh, I kind of trapped myself just a little bit. At the same time, it is pretty awesome. Seen this much loot. It's, it's pretty nice. It's pretty nice. Okay, grab this. Okay, finally. Alright, and certain about your warrior, you're my friend now. Oops, he's. Come on, mouse. It does that every single time. Eh, I don't need any of that. Great, another cave. Okay, do that. Okay, what's in here? Besides an azure. <sighs> mining is dangerous. Gosh darn it. Because I've been wasting so much time on just mining all this crap, but at the same time I need all this. If the mine goes critical, we'll just put a teleporter down. I was hoping to get down to 2,000 before it, w it went dangerous, but, you know, what are you going to do? Oh my gosh, there's so much stuff. Um, oh, Mithril, nice. Uh, this stuff takes forever to mine, but I guess I can do it. They might have sped it up, actually. Although the, uh, the blaster really helps. Because I remember this being such a pain to mine. It spawns at like between I think it's either sixteen or seventeen hundred and uh, nineteen hundred ninety-nine. So a very small window to get a pretty awesome ore, and it's very rare. I usually just find them in the caves or whatever. Rainbow Knight's easy to mine. Look how many ores I have.
Uh, we could mine that azure. Is there is that a mithril or? No, that's a rainbow knight. Let's grab this last azure and we'll keep digging. Let's hope I can at least get to the two thousands before uh, the mine decides to go nuts. Did I miss? No, I, I got it right on the spot. Sweet. Okay. Oh, yes, I can reach. Good. I think the surrender my pickaxe has better or the same reach as Mithril. The pickaxe that has the best reach, I think, is either Dragonite or Amethyst. I, I think it's Dragonite. But Dragonite has terrible strength, so... Okay, this is, yeah, this is the mine, right? Here. Look at all this. Okay. Let's get down where we need. We are getting useful stuff like copper. Azure is actually pretty common. I know a lot of people say that uh, it's rare. Oh, mithril, nice. Uh, let me speed that up, actually. I know uh, people say that Azure is rare. It's not. It is useful, but it's not rare. Oops. Uh, darn it. Yeah, it is for sure useful, but it's not rare. It's not that rare. Um, I'd say it's about as rare as, like, I don't know, um, maybe, maybe Rainbow Knight. Either Rainbow Knight or Opal. It's not really that rare. Can I get these sword? Can I get these ores out of this? Like, holy crap! Okay, let me push these out. Stupid things. They yeah, were getting in my way because I kept clicking the surrender bite. I don't need surrender by anymore, and I, I don't want to get the emblem that takes way, way too long. I'd be spending like four hours trying to get that emblem. Is there anything in there? Uh, I think maybe like an azure or something. There's a mithril. I can grab that, actually. No. How could that reach? Yeah, there's a mithril. I guess I can grab that one. And I'll grab the unobtainium. I always want to grab the Mithril. I actually do want the emblem for Mithril. I think it looks awesome. The The moon looks really, really cool. Yeah, the moon shape emblem. Yeah, I think it looks awesome. Because I don't think I need it for anything else. I think it was only used for a pickaxe and maybe like one or two upgrades. It's not really that useful, but it's just so cool. No, it's just a super neat ore. Uh, that is the cave, right? Yeah, it is. I hate having no legs. Zer, you know, I'm just gonna skip it. I'm almost to 2000. A dragon glass. Bright light. I don't really need half the stuff down here. Uh, we'll start mining a whole bunch of crap once we get to 25. 25 or 2600. Once uh, we get to fire crystal level, that's when we need stuff. Because there's lots of useful things. 
Fire Crystal, uh, which I actually don't really need, but I need it so I can uh, mine Symmetrium. Or Symmetrium. Uh, you need the Frustarian Pickaxe to get it, uh, which I do have. I've had it for, for a while. Back when uh, Frustarium was first released, I had the Pickaxe, so... It's pretty easy to get. I think you need like a 150 frost arrow. It's really easy to get. Oh, jeez. That's not good. These guys are strong. Nice. Move. Go. Turn glass. See more enemies up there. What's even up here? Just an enemy. No. 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 I'm almost dead. Crap, I'm trapped. This is a bunch of pain, uh, pain I... Boo. Whoa, what is that emblem? Yeah, that emblem looks cool. That, that, uh, I'll just say that's element V, but no, I don't know what emblem that is. Actually, let me ask him, hold on. Yes, I have Newtonium. Uh, usually I have Fire Crystal on, but. Ha oh, Havium. Oh, okay. I don't know what that is. Actually, where do you get that? Where. Do you get that ore? Yeah, I've never seen that ore. Where do you get that? Max level market. Ah, okay. Gotcha. Okay, I want to at least get to 2500 before this mine explodes. It's one of three for two. Dang! That's expensive, dude. One, one to three for two to three million coins. Holy crap! That's an awesome emblem, then. Okay, that's a that that seems like a plain annoying one to get. All right, go away. Get out of here. Thank you. A lot of people are at, uh, 3,000. Takes me ages to get to 3,000. Because usually I get, usually I just get sidetracked. Okay, I want to at least get to 25 game. Right where Fire Crystal spawns. Okay, beautiful. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, mine this all out. I'm gonna place a teleporter down. Okay, there we go. Uh, place. I'll put it. I'll put it there. It doesn't really matter where you put it. Uh, okay, I actually do need to grab my uh, thingy majiggy, uh, the special pickaxe. Uh, there it is, Frustarium. Super low stats. Really terrible pickaxe, but you need it to mine the, spe uh, the special ore. Oh gosh, it's slow. Okay, hold on. You also get a lot of XP from mining fire crystal. 80,000's a lot. Also, the emblem that you're wondering uh, that that uh, other player has, Bear Ghost, that's a, uh, I think that's like Fright Stone or something like that, which is a 4,000 uh, ore. 4,000 deep. It's really uh, hard to get down there. 
Wow, there's a couple super deities in here. This guy's got a surrender by emblem. Oh, jeez, he's probably spent hours trying to get that. Either that or he's got a Newtonium pickaxe. He, he probably does. He probably does have a Newtonium. Because that takes so long to do. I missed. I missed again. Okay, there we go. Serendibite. Uh, 174 Serendibite. Jeez, dude. 104 Seren uh, 174 Serendibite. Holy crap. Wait, is there a, uh, a, a Symmetrium up there? There might be, actually. I see a blue tinge. Oh, yeah, there's got to be one in here. Yeah, there's got to be one. I can see a bluish tinge in there. I think it's like... That's my teleport pad. Uh, is it over here? I know for sure there is one, so I'm going to keep looking. Wow, where is it? Wow, where is it? Are you serious? There's clearly a blue glow, unless that's my teleporter. I guess it's my teleporter or something. I legit thought there was one that spawned. Alright, whatever. It definitely looks like one did, but no. Okay, whatever. And that's a pain if you're wondering. Um, let's check over here. Mine is so gonna reset. I gotta empty crap so bad. I gotta empty so much stuff. I probably should do that really quick. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna do that really fast. Just so I can see my level. So much stuff. Teleport pads are just so underrated. And I mean underrated, I mean they're just straight up awesome. I shouldn't even say underrated because almost everyone uses these darn things. People know how OP these things are. Also, I watched someone go down to like 4,500, which is insane. I'm like, dude, that would take me, like, because my mining depth isn't even, it isn't even past that, I'm barely at 3,000, it would take me about maybe a half hour to get down there, maybe even longer, so, okay, where are these fire crystals? Finally. I was like, where are these darn things? By the way, if you're wondering how much symmetry I have, I think I have like 20, I think. So, somewhere around there. I know I don't have a lot, though. Because it's not really that easy to get. Because what you do is you mine the fire crystal with the frustarium, and then it is there's only a chance that the symmetrium will spawn. So it's really annoying. You'll know it's it spawns when um, there's like a bluish glow where you mine. Yeah, then you'll know that a Symmetrium form. 
it's really annoying. It's one of the most annoying ores to mine, or to actually find. <clears throat> the only ores I've had, like, just major issues just trying to find are uh, Symmetrium and Prometheum. Prometheum definitely being up there. Dude, my, uh, the mine conditions went from, uh, I think it was, um, I think it was from risky to critical. And guess how many Prometheum I found? Three. Three. Three Prometheum in that amount of time. So it's pretty annoying to find. It's it's about as rare as Mithril. So, oh, okay, definitely a Symmetrium form. I think it's, is it there? Yeah, there it is. Sweet. And these things take about as long as Surrender Bite. <laughs> Fantastic. Yeah, about, about as long. Maybe a little, like maybe a tiny bit shorter. Yeah, they take a little while. But at the same time, we're, we're using a weak pickaxe. If I was using Mithril, this would go down pretty quickly. And you get about 100k, which is pretty good. You don't really use it for anything. I think it's just the... Uh, the emblem. I don't think uh, it might be used for one pickaxe, and I know it's not used for any upgrades because it was it was introduced uh, quite a while ago, or actually uh, quite recently, my add. Um, it was added when the frostarium was added. It's a weird ore, that's for sure. Gosh, if only this was faster. My mithril's so much faster than this. Which isn't surprising, because mithril is like one of the best big axes in the game. It's either fourth or fifth yeah it's just behind Newtonium in terms of like raw strength in terms of usefulness it's like like sixth so yeah and the reason why I'm saying sixth because it's beat out my Moonstone Moonstone is so good it's great for uh, for when uh, you're trying to do master to wizard and wizard to overlord, you absolutely need, need, need uh, the Moonstone pickaxe. Because it gives you, I, I believe, like 30% more XP. It's, it's so good. It's so good. Oh, nice. Right above it. I might do some Minecraft again at some point. I've been doing a lot of training and stuff on there. Uh, my aim is still sucky. So. And I recently uh, won a 1v1 with someone. Uh, it was like 33 to 27. So I did okay. Okay, I did not know two spawned. Okay, I did not know that actually multiple uh, spawned from one fire crystal. Okay, that I actually did not know. That's probably pretty rare. <laughs> I've never seen that, let alone I've never even seen a content creator even do that either. Comment down below if you know how rare that is. Wow, uh, that's interesting. Cool. Two symmetriums. Let's hope I can mine this before the mine resets. Although the mine resetting isn't really my main concern. 
because teleporting down here is easy. But jeez, I'm getting really lucky here. Also, if you're wondering, I do have the fire crystal, em uh, fire crystal emblem. So I'm just mining this just so I can get Symmetrium to form. Heck yeah, dude. conditions are critical yes they are very critical I have almost as much symmetrium as fire crystal that's awesome sweet oh heck yeah dude I made it awfully lucky with this Because last time I did this, I went through like six fire crystal without even seeing one symmetrium. And now, like, look at this. Also, if you're wondering, there is no pickaxe uh, designated this. There is no Symmetrium pickaxe, as far as I know. Because I am up to Mithril right now. Jeez, dude. Wow, I'm getting lucky. Let's go. Let's hope this uh, this luck carries over to uh, U4. Because I'm going to be doing U4 tonight. Let's see if we can get to, I don't know. How much symmetry should we get? 20? Mm, that's not bad. I, I could go 20. We'll see. Oh, jeez. Yeah, I'll definitely get to 20, especially when I'm getting frequent Symmetriums like this. Like, dude, with this, we have the same Fire Crystal as Symmetrium. <sighs> okay. Nice. That's another two. Ah! I couldn't mine it. Quick before the mine decides to cave in on me. All right, there we go. Ah! Nuts. Well, that sucked. I probably should have put a teleporter down. <laughs> Just saying. Uh, I didn't expect that one. Well, that sucks. Uh, <laughs> it. Yeah, how much symmetry do I have? 24. Crap. Uh, yeah, that sucks. I might as well see if we can get some Garnet. Yeah, sure, why not? Let's reset my character and let's see how much Garnet I can get. And then I'm going to end this off. That sucks. <laughs> I can't believe that happened. Oh my gosh. Let's just collect all this. 
shop what he got for me. Actually, you know what? Let's let's upgrade this. Yeah, there we go. Better stuff now. Uh, yeah, sure. Game. Game. We got. Okay. That is not cooperate. I might crash actually. What even spawned? What? Uh, moonstone? Oh, there is a moonstone. Yeah, let's grab that. Hold on. Let me get my mithril. Mithril. Equip. Yes. Never mind. Can I mind that? Never mind. You thief! Who is this? Oh, that's the guy with the surrender by emblem thingy. I was gonna grab those. Huh. Oh well. Grab this. Okay. What do we got? Wait, do I have to click on it? Oh, I was gonna say, did I close it off? No. Okay. What do we got? Any on it? Oh, there is. Takes forever to mine, but it's so worth it. It's just plain annoying to get. It's not hard to find. It's just annoying to get. I know someone's saying, uh, someone said that Garnet is the rarest ore. Oh, <laughs> far from it. No, it's not the rarest ore. No, the rarest ore is Ambrosia. Behind that is uh, Nihilium, I think is what it's called. Which I believe it's a, uh, I believe that's a Halloween ore. Um, has, I think, rarity similar to, I, I think, uh, I think it's actually higher than Mithril. I think very slightly higher than Mithril. But, yeah, uh, people say that it's about as rare as, uh, as Ambrosia. So, I don't know. I've never seen the ore. One step closer to that garnet emblem. Which would be nice to get. Also, no one ever goes in these back uh, these back rooms over here, so... Basically, whatever you can find out here, uh, in terms of garnet... Grab. <laughs> grab the garnet. So... Because these servers are so dead, so basically, whatever garnet you can find back here, it's yours. So. Uh, there's one, I believe, over here. Yep. There's quite a few, actually. There's one over, over there in the corner, right where Beresa is. Yeah, I'll do person geometry dash tomorrow. I'm definitely gonna beat that darn level uh, in silico. I'm beating that. It's just that death sucked, so like a lot. Also, I've been playing a lot of uh, U4, uh, like quite a bit um, off screen. Guess what nation I was playing as? How about Dawas here? Yeah, I was playing as Dawas here. Um, very fun, very strong, very, very strong. Uh, definitely a powerhouse. Um, great for Vassal Swarming. Like, you can definitely uh, pull off a nice Vassal Swarm as that was here. Um, right now, I've Vassalized Elodia and Bangola. Um, and I'm about ready to uh, Vassalize Hormuz. So, yeah, and I'm pretty big. Uh, the Mamluks actually don't hate me, so that's helpful. Um, and the Ottomans also don't hate me, so I can get a clutch alliance with them. 
and uh, turn on the Mamluks. So, so far it's been a, a pretty calm game. Uh, we are extremely poor, obviously, because we're in Arabia. So, um, really, unless you're Hormuz, you're going to lose a bunch of money. So, yeah, unless you're Hormuz. Hormuz is easily the richest out of all those those nations in Arabia. Unless you're talking about the Mamluks, but the, the Mamluks I don't really count, since that's obvious. Since they started as a great power, no one else does in that, that region. Is there any other Garnet, or is that it? Looks like it was just four. Okay, cool. Uh, let's just one up here. Nope. Okay. Very good. Let's get back to Azure Mines. And I'll go store all those garnets and see how much I have. I remember someone saying, hey, can I have a garnet? I'm like, yeah, sure. There was just one. I can easily get that back. And there we go. 28. So easy. All right, oops. BM Rainbow Star. Okay, uh, let's see what the mines are like. Actually, wait, actually, did they change this over here? Also, yeah, they removed that. I don't believe there's anything over there. And that, that's just like a, that's like a scam, I think, over there. I don't know why it's over there. I have boomite. Hi, boomite. Boomite. You can do the layers. How do you? How do I get rubies? Uh, I think it's like two hundred to. I think it's like right around that region. You don't have this ore unlocked. I, I, of course I don't have that ore unlocked. Twitch eye? I have no twitch eye, dude. A gun. Oh, that's cool. Oh, like, oh it's 7? Oh, it's 70? I thought it was uh, 200. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if they changed it or not. And there's all the pickaxes in the game. That right there, that's, I think, Amethyst right there. That's Opal. That's Dragonite. Or Dragonglass, sorry. That's... Painite, I think, right there. Unless that's Painite. What is that? Is that Fire Crystal? I don't know. That's Mithril. That's Moonstone. That's... Oh, no, that's Frustarium. That's, no, that's Azure. Sorry, that's Azure. That's Painite. That's, uh, Serendibite. No, that's Azure. Then what the heck is that? What is that pickaxe? Hold on. Is that, a? Uh, is that the Garnet one? No, that's Garnet. That's Azure. Is that Amethyst? No, that's not Amethyst. No, that's not that one. It's not that one. Is it Frustar? No, it's not, it's not that one. It's not bad. Is it platinum? No. I don't know. I don't know what that pickaxe is right here. Oh, that might be a Vahalium. I don't know, actually. I don't know what pickaxe that is. That's gold. That's garnet. That's dragon glass. Okay, so th this one, I don't even know. That uh, Probably Vahalium. Like, store them in the inventory. Never mind. Oh, jeez. Yeah, U.S. Soccer Tycoon. Oh, yeah, it's an ad. Why is that there? Also, yeah, they almost made this uh, useless. This is a... Uh, yeah, Billy Swag Shop. The Master Merchant. Uh, that's actually how I got that dragon over there. Uh, 
there was like a pink dragon like quest thing um it was it was out for like a month um and i got it and i got the that dragon it's uh like a cosmetic thing that's that and then that's the uh yeah the materials and stuff but you you have this so it's no point so yeah oh ooh, ruby okay so all right well i'm gonna go and end off the uh video here but you guys enjoyed not a great ending to that unfortunately because i messed up my teleport or whatever well actually no technically i didn't mess up my teleport i didn't mine fast enough i didn't mine far enough so i fell out of the map so um yeah there's no way i'll be able to get back down there unless i like fall all the way back down and um teleport at my base and then fall down like that but i i don't think it's even worth it it's whatever i can mine back down there anyways and i and i can also get all the materials and stuff needed so yeah but i uh, hope you guys enjoyed i'll see you all in the next video which will be in about i don't know a half hour or so and it'll be uh european universal s4 will be uh continuing the uh hardest start series so i will see you all in the next video goodbye